we'll offer the pay and hit the pay. Om Shivam Santikari Brahmani Brahmanapya Sharmuloka Punetincha Brunamami Sadashiva Esha Sachandana Pushpanjali Om Sri Dukarainama Om Mundalam Shambhanam Siddham Nishkalam Ramangalam Visheshari Vishamatam Trandikam Pranumamma Kesha Shachandara Vishpanjali Om Sri Vigayana Om Charbhodeva Moim Devi much for this invitation extended to me on behalf of the 
Bengal Association of Tokyo to attend the Durga Puja this morning. I was earlier here in the same hall for the Saraswati Puja. And uh, we are now on the cusp of the festival season, having just celebrated Ganesh Chaturthi, now celebrating Durga Puja. We will celebrate Dashera and soon it will be Diwali. And on this very happy and festive occasion, I wish uh, each one of you good health and success. I am also very really happy that I could launch the Anjali magazine today, which commemorates 100 years of uh, Rabindranath Tagore's first visit to Japan in 1916. Rabindranath Tagore himself had said of Japan that the Japanese people have mastered the secrets of nature. And this was his own Anjali, or tribute, to the excellence of the Japanese people. And today we see this in various forms, in the achievements of Japan. And these we hope to replicate in India as well, through our deep engagement with Japan and our special strategic and global partnership. On October 2, in India, the Prime Minister inaugurated the Pravasiya Bharatiya Kendra, which as the name suggests, will be a home for the diaspora of India, including the Bengalis that are to be found in considerable numbers all over the world, including in Japan. And I think in Japan, it is the Bengalis that led the way. It is the Bengalis that have contributed much to the development of friendship and cooperation between our two countries. And I do know for a fact that they are held in very high esteem. As you all know, the world wants to engage with India today. And as our Prime Minister said on the occasion of the inauguration of the Pravasya Bharatiya Kendra in India, India too wants to engage the world. And I think each one of you will play a very important role. You will be the bridge that creates this architecture of friendship between India and the rest of the world. Once again, on this happy occasion, my warmest greetings on behalf of the Embassy, on behalf of the Government of India and all my colleagues present here this morning. Shubho Durga Puja. Thank you, Your Excellency. We were very happy to today um, uh, to uh, we have with us a very prominent singer from Ramita Shamit singer from Kolkata, who is going to grace the occasion today also, Romita Moldi, and she will be performing in, within our cultural program, which will be held later during the day. Thank you, Romita.